it's about quarter past ten now. <laughs> um, I let's backtrack a little. Good afternoon. Hi. I hope you guys are amazing. Today is a big day. Today is Cotton Fest. And it's my first ever one. So I was like, yeah, mm, I'm definitely going. There's no way that I'm backing out. I'm currently even wearing my outfit. Just It was just to double check if it actually looks fine and whatever. And also I was showing my friends what I'm wearing. Yeah, let me go to the mirror. Yeah, again, my room is a complete mess, but like, fit check. This sweater vest is actually brand new. I got it from H&M like last week. And then these pants, these pants belonged to my mom, but she didn't like them. Well, she didn't like how it sat on her, so she just gave it to me. And then, yeah, this top is from, I mean, this white top is from zara and these pants are from zara by the way um and then i'm wearing it with my dr martens which i thought was the best choice because it's very sandy where we're going like in terms of in case my shoes get dirty i think this would be the best bet and i'm only wearing long sleeve because we're going at night i know joburg and i know that it gets quite chilly at night so I was not about to take chances wearing a t-shirt. Guys, I have not even had breakfast yet. And it's 1 p.m. I took a run at like half past 10. And then, yeah, I chilled after that. I'm gonna have a square. My apple square. I ran out of cheese. And I'm not very happy about that. But you know what? It, it's, it's fine. We move. But at least like at the place, they have food and stuff. Later on, I can get like little snacks or whatever i need to pack my stuff and i'm gonna be meeting up with my friends so four of us are staying in an airbnb in rosebank so i'll show you guys that i'll take you guys with me get ready with me you know the the stuff that youtubers do let's just might as well call this like a south african coachella get ready with me i don't know I'm only going for one day. I only have a Saturday pass because I, I was not in the mood to go for two days. So although that's happening, I'm still staying at the place, at the Airbnb tomorrow as well. Um, so yeah, that's the tea then. I'm gonna pack my stuff and then eat. Oh, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Guys, we just arrived at our Airbnb. I actually forgot to vlog quite a bit, but I will just show you. I mean, I'll just tell you what happened. I'm with my mates. Sure, <laughs> I'll introduce them properly when we're inside. Guys, this place looks so cute. I cannot. I can't wait to show you guys inside. It's so cute. Were we supposed to follow the lady? Okay. <laughs> Wait, do I give you guys a house tour now? No, wait, let's put our bags down first. Okay, let me give you guys a proper house tour. So, this is a room that, um, I think Notema and I are gonna stay in because our bags are right here. And then, there's a mirror. Yeah. <laughs> there's stairs, it's a double story. Oh, snap, let me introduce you guys. So, this is Notemba. Hi. <laughs> Here's Zani, or Toko Zani. <laughs> you look so bad. You guys look fine. In this other room, I suspect there's like master room vibes. Because, you know, one bed. And there's even a TV hidden here. And a little balcony. Oh, it's the same balcony as ours. But I didn't go outside. There's our view! It's so pretty here! There's even... <gasps> there's a bathroom very cute oh what a nice shower i love nice showers jeez and there's a toilet there's for some reason i will assume that this is just decoration and not actual oh, showers <laughs> this petunia just say hi, hi. <laughs> and then here's the living space 
Um, living area. And he has a little kitchen. Oh my gosh, this toast is so pretty. Oh my gosh. And this is everything. So nice. And they even have a mini like little pantry. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> There's a little outside area. Another TV. And you see her. And then funeral chairs. It's not funeral chairs. <laughs> it's not funeral chairs. <laughs> At least front yard. Here's another walkway. Yeah, that's basically the place, man. It is so pretty here. It's so pretty. OMG, let me tell you guys some of the shandies that has just happened <laughs> at the hour train. I completely forgot to film, but also it was like a crime alert space outside. So taking your phone up is a risk. But anyway, as I was saying, don't mind the towel. Ah! Oh my armpit! Oh! Okay, so we were there at the Khao train and we ordered a bolt to come to this place now. The bolt driver pitches, he parks by the Khao train, we come to the car, he looks at us, one glance, didn't even change facial expression, nothing. And then he vibed. Just like that! Make it make sense! And then he just cancelled the journey just like that, which is, uh, I mean, okay. Okay, I guess. Maybe he like just looked at our luggage and then he was like, ah, never mind. No, no, no. In general, there's a boot for a reason. But anyway, so that happened. And then we ordered another boat and that went fine. So here we are in the place. We're only going to leave in like maybe an hour-ish. I will take you guys with me. Which I'm not even taking the phone that I'm filming on right now. I'm taking my old phone. Um, cause, eh. I think it's just easier to take care of a tiny phone as opposed to a big one. So. Okay, we're leaving. Yes. Wait, selfie cameras. For check, I guess. Um, yeah. Okay guys, we're currently at the location. Um, I love this song! Anyway, there's a place. I feel like the quality is so ass, but you guys will just have to... Yeah, you guys will just have to deal with it. Okay guys, seeing Genile, we are like within within. Or at least me. I'm still waiting for Petunia and Zani. Currently waiting for November to get here. She's coming out with a friend. So we're gonna meet her here inside. I must let you guys know though, I'm not gonna film too much because I don't you want like that. Virginia, I'm right here! Virginia is the only one. Is she not there? Is she not no, inside? Her pass is not going through. Okay, Petunia's pass is not going through. Um it better go through, there's no other way. But anyway. Huh? Are you vlogging? Yes I am. <laughs> Um, yeah, I must say I'm not gonna film too much tonight because I need battery. Check these guys. How cool! And then this is Anya's one because it's a weekend pass. Exactly what's happening. Was they bad. scanned the ticket twice oh. at the gate, and then when they looked, they were like, "It's been used," and it's like, "Can't John, you win? It's my first time yet." Gotcha. So I had to drive to the black tents. They had to check and be like, oh, "Wait, but that's right now. Let me walk with you exactly. and fix it." Exactly. And yeah. We're within, we can pass. Thank God. The actual place. So, this downstairs, we're going upstairs now.
baby size. Thank you. <laughs> Who's that? Wife and son. Who? Ricky's wife and son. Holy. Okay. There's so many famous people here, guys. Who's this? Reggie, the boys. Oh, the boys are insane. Yeah. We finally met up with Natema. She has Aretha, her friend. But check from the top. Oh, <laughs> oh I took a bit of the song. By the hip hop stage. There's three stages, imagine. Hey guys, so here I am doing like a post credit, post, post cotton fest thoughts, opinion, um, my experience. Okay, so overall, amazing. 10 out of 10, 11 out of 10. Absolutely loved the festival. I'm definitely going again next year. In fact, next year, next year we are all bringing our A games. Like, I knew it was a place for, like, you know, content creators, influencers, you know, celebrities go there. I knew that, but, like, 
I didn't know it was gonna be like this. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why I said it like that. But you, do you guys get what I'm saying? You look this way, you look that way, you look that way. Everyone's dressed up to the T. Taking pictures in front of graphic walls. There's ring lights at like most stalls. Okay, not most, but like the MTV base stall had like a ring light and whatever for you to take boomerangs and tag them and all of that stuff. I, I didn't know it was like the place for content creators, but it was just crazy like witnessing it all in person. You know, the whole pictures every two seconds, selfies every two seconds of crazy outfits. And beside that, the actual like music part of the festival, 11 out of 10. That was amazing. There were obviously a few moments where like, you know, things didn't go as planned and whatever. Not big things, but like my channel is for wholesome vibes only so <laughs> i'm not gonna get into that um but overall the actual the actual festival absolutely amazing loved it if you're busy wondering should i go next year yeah please go to the next one and then again it's also my first ever music festival so before this i had never been to a concert festival but for my first time it was absolutely amazing i must say my favorite performance was definitely this part where there was like a tribute to Ricky Rick and oh my days there was a choir and everything and like in the back they would play some of his interviews and like some of the things that he said like some messages to us and all of it. oh my days it was so touching I cried personally um yeah i'm sure a lot of people did too because it was wow and then they even like incorporated like his songs after that so then they'll play like boys um you know that song yeah they would even like uh, add like a choir-ish version of it and then like instrumentals and everything oh it was so good and then in terms of like actual performances i honestly all the people that I saw because um, we only got there at six all the people that I was actually like in the crowd like in the main by the main stage for personally I think they all did a really good job so I don't think I have like a favorite favorite performance to also mention it was so cool meeting some people in person or like seeing some people in person that like I only know digitally it was so cool like some people that i only know digitally i would like want to go greet them but i was like ah, i'm gonna try you know so some of them like i only saw but like i didn't like actually greet but yeah i loved the cotton man he was so cute he had like a big round head and like oh my gosh whoever the guy was that was like the actual mascot the dance moves oh that was the cutest thing i've ever witnessed oh my days and i loved how like they would even play like a few animations in the back of like some dancey dancey characters and all of that like wow okay talk too much um yeah thank you so much for watching if you made it this far i hope you really enjoyed it because i thoroughly thoroughly enjoyed this event have an amazing day further or evening or morning or you get you get my boy yeah okay peace out <laughs>